Hey everyone, today we vlog, we are in Cambodia taking on an exciting walking tour of AM Mall 3. It has a movie theater, a place to run, a kids park, arcade room, a grocery store. It's like a Target inside the mall. Phnom Penh's newest largest shopping sensation. We will uncover our top three must-try restaurants and reveal our favorite retail stores to shop at. You might be surprised by our picks. By the end of this video, you will have all the insider tips you need for our unforgettable visit to Aeon Mall 3. Here's a short clip of what's to come. Here we are at AM Mall 3, and I have to say, it's impressive from the outside. But we're not just here to look at the exterior, we're diving deep to explore everything this mall has to offer. As soon as you step inside, you're greeted by an incredible array of LED screens. They're absolutely everywhere. Even the pillars are wrapped in these vibrant displays. It's visually stunning and truly unlike anything I've ever seen before. The layout is incredible. It's spacious, modern, and inviting. But let's not get too comfortable because we have a lot to cover. Now, onto one of my my favorite parts, the food. AL Mall 3 boasts an impressive variety of dining options. Today we're checking out our top 3 must try restaurants. Let's start off with number 1. First on the list, Shabu Shabu and Sushi Buffet. I'm a huge sushi fan and Shabu Shabu does not disappoint. Fresh, flavorful, and beautifully presented. Let's dig in. Okay. When you come here during the weekday, it's pretty slow, honestly. And we tend to do things like avoid the crowd. That's why we came during the weekday. And it felt like we had the whole room to ourselves. I love this place because the meat quality was great. Seafood was fresh, tasted really well. I was really full afterward and it was $13.50. Second choice, more budget friendly, is barbecue, meat, and rice. What we usually order from here is the papaya salad. So you pay cash here on the right side, and then the papaya salad is really good here. They make it fresh. It's around dollar fifty for just the papaya salad, and if you want to add any meat like shrimp, it's an extra dollar, so it's two fifty. What we do normally, we order some number joe on the way there and. We to the mall and we would mix the nomachoke 
with the papaya salad. So you're looking at about $3 for a good meal that, that will fill you up pretty well. The papaya salad, as you can see in the video, that they make each order fresh. If you want shrimp, the five pieces. Oh, by the way, it's raw, okay? And then also the crab is raw. But for me, man, it tasted really good. I'm gonna sound weird, but eating raw shrimp and raw crab. But it is delicious, guys. It's just like eating raw sushi. It tastes very good. And we mix it up with the spiciness and the nomucho. You stir it all up as the pond is doing here. And it just, it's just amazing and affordable. So the final spot on this list is Red Top. Now, how did a bakery make it into this is particularly one item that I tried here and believe me I tried many items at this place this is the, by far the one that stood out it's very crispy on the outside it's filled with Boston cream just one another bite it's pretty good one time I went to Aeon Mall they literally sold out in the front so I walked to the back and they had the proof box set up with the warmer and everything and they have freshly made of uh, this particular item that I show you here and look, I have a background of, uh, of being a, a donut shop owner and, and baking donuts so I know when I try something it's, it's fresh and so it's it's one of those things about bread talk um, there's like a few other different bakeries in there I tried it all and I think bread talk tops them all to be honest and so yeah, I definitely recommend that. These restaurants not only satisfy your hunger, but also give you a taste of diverse culinary landscape here in Phnom Penh. After fueling up, it's time to hit the stores. Aeon Mall 3 is a shopper's paradise. Here are our top three favorite retail stores. Number one, Decathlon. It's huge. I mean, they have outdoor volleyball court, have a place to play soccer, basketball. Unfortunately, at the time, the camera ran out of the battery but it's, it's just a nice place personally i always get all of my running gear from that from decathlon and also uh their shoes so retail store number two is padini concept store my wife Zipan, loves to shop here she usually gets shoes or outfit personally i like the t-shirts that they have here and the jeans that's why we park the way we park because right when you go into the entrance it's the first store on the right <laughs> So store number three is Brands Outlet. Now for those who love fashion and classic style with a modern twist, these clothes are very affordable and if you're looking to be on more of a budget friendly, I definitely recommend Brands Outlet because they have a lot of sales going on. If you, you can just watch watch the video clip here. Uh, let's 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 see what kind of deals we got and See if you could like you guys like the clothes in here. Now for as a bonus, if you're looking for deals as well, even at the Aeon store. So Aeon, the way they have it set up, like the first floor Aeon is they have some clothes right when you go in, and then at the very back is the grocery store. On that second floor, they have a lot of deals. I even had bought this uh one set of a men's shirt with shorts matching set for five dollars very comfortable fabric these stores offer something for everyone whether you're a sports enthusiast a fashion lover or just looking for some retail therapy i have to admit i love walking and exploring new places but there's a bit of tension here you see some fun can shop for hours on end and i'm not sure if i can keep up now it didn't take long for me to get pretty bored you know, seeing Zapong shop and whatnot. So I figured I use the excuse that I always do. Hey babe, I gotta go make a YouTube video. I just took Martin out to Gomsan Park. It's an outdoor park. Man, it is amazing. Like there is so many activities that the kids can do. Not only for the kids, but for the adults as well, man. Like it has a, a trail that you can walk and see. Like overall, the fact that you can have something like this for free. You know, you have a swimming area for the kids you can have the kids play in the sand go on the slides place where it's like a camp field kind of area where they can just bounce in the net or even do the, the zip line they had a nice uh, view area in the very center of it all where you can just walk up the stairs and enjoy the fountain and just sit down relax you know you can read a book um, meditate 
it's just a really cool and vibrant area where you can just chill you know find some peace of mind and at the same time your kids are in your eyesight and you can watch them at the same time from a distance and you're not worried because everything is closed in and the locals are very nice understanding because you know Martin he's only two throughout the process of him playing other parents were aware that their kids were a lot bigger and they were like you know explaining to their kids like hey be careful let the let let Martin go first because he's younger <laughs> something that a way to not be so bored as as a man you know we, we like seeing things visually active i have to say it's a bit of a marathon but it's also a lot of fun there's so much to see and do here and the variety keeps things interesting one of the coolest features of am mod 3 is the sky bridge it has a glass floor that offers a thrilling view of the mall from above let's check there's it out. a walking track inside of Aeon mall number three look at this bro it says 250 meters this must be the starting point where we're at right now it's a full led screen from the top all the way to the bottom and right in front of it is the sky bridge this mall is huge this is a glass where Apparently you can see below. Let me see. Oh, oh gosh. I'm getting paranoid. Really paranoid. Who thought of this idea? But uh, it's pretty cool. It's both exhilarating and a little nerve-wracking to walk on glass, but the view is totally worth it. So another feature in this mall that I really love, when we went on the weekend, they actually host movie nights where it was actually a K-drama going on and it's pretty dope, man. Like you can see like how many people are actually watching and it's absolutely free and it's cool. Like Aeon Mall 3, I think is more than just a place where you can go shopping. I think it's Aeon Mall is doing something that's more than just that is it's about building a community because of the activities they have set up i mean i mean who who would go to a mall and expect to see a live curse uh, a live circus event you see these uh, of men and women coming together and displaying their talents Now wasn't that amazing? And that was free. They constantly host these kind of events once a month. And there's also times where we ran into Ginny, who is a famous content creator. And then you will see other content creators in this pool. What? an adventure has been from exploring the amazing led displays to indulging in delicious food and navigating through a shopping marathon aeon mod 3 is, truly has it all it's not just about shopping it's about the experiencing a whole new level of entertainment and convenience i hope you enjoyed this walking tour as much as i did if you're planning a trip to Phnom Penh, cambodia make sure aeon mod 3 is on your list trust me you won't be disappointed Thanks for joining me on this venture and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more exciting content. Until next time, 
stay adventurous, and keep exploring. From the heart of Phnom Penh, this is Philip signing off. See you in the next episode of We Love Cambodia. But, uh, let's, let's do it again and go up. So we're going up now. เออจ้าตะไว้เก๋ตะไว้เอาตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว้ตะไว